morning everybody, welcome to another Morning Word. Thank you for joining us this morning. For those new to this, this is where we share a couple minute video, really the sharing from my own personal Bible study. Once again, I'm not a pastor, not an evangelist, but work for the church as someone who fallen and fell in love with God, okay, and fell in love with this word and saw him take my life from here to here. And I just really wanted to share that with the world and really inspire you to get into the word for yourself. Don't listen to me, who am I? But get into the word yourself. That's the real reason behind Morning Word. So you can get your own daily inspiration. So let's really get into this for those obviously taking notes and everybody should be taking notes so you can verify what I'm saying is true. Okay, we're going to be reading from the book of Exodus chapter 8 verse 5 to 7 and it reads this. Then the Lord said to Moses, tell Aaron, stretch out your hand with your staff over the streams and the canals and the ponds and make frogs come up out of the land of Egypt. Wow, it's pretty impressive, right? So Aaron stretched out his hand over the waters of Egypt and the frogs came and covered the land of Egypt. But, here we now, but the magicians did the same things by their secret arts. They also made frogs come up out of the land. Now, here we see a man of God and people who are doing dark magic both doing the same thing, okay? Both doing exactly the same thing. Both would be like, whoa, do you have the power to do that? And this is the thing really I was looking at is that when people perform or conduct amazing things, we can be in awe of their power. We can be in awe of their success, okay? And that's, and that's good. And on the surface, it all looks good. Both people did great things, okay? On the surface, but below you had someone, okay, who was doing things with a genuine heart, okay? And, 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 and in good. And then another man who was trying to do something, okay, but had a dark heart, okay? But in the service, both look amazing. But it's not until you dig down that you start to see that some people can perform miracles or look really successful, but have a real dark and sadistic heart. You've got to be careful that you don't get sucked into the performance, okay, without actually looking at the source. Don't get sucked into the performance without looking at the source and that's really the you know the message of what we we're trying to say today and we see this all the time though in life okay you may be impressed on, on instagram now that you see someone driving a bmw or you know has a bretlin watch or all kinds of riches and fame and being really successful but that same guy's a drug dealer are you still going to praise him compared to the guy who yes he's successful and drives a bmw and has a bretlin and i've got no problems with guys doing that or having that or women having that it's your thing okay but that guy worked hard and worked 15 hour days, built a business that, that gave a, 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 you know, products to the world that we wanted, okay? So like a Steve Jobs or something like that. But then there's someone else who's got that same level of success, but they're doing it in, dark, in a dark way. So here's the question that, the question of the day, the question of, or question of the morning is this. Uh, are you suckered in by the performance without checking the source? Are you suckered in by people's performance without checking their source? Okay, here's the thing. Lesson of the day is this. Not all things that glisten is gold. Okay? In life, people will suck you in with their financial, okay, their financial scams. They suck you in and they look really credible. And then you get into them, okay? And then it's a big financial scam. We've seen it all the time with people sucking into investments that they shouldn't be. Okay? We've got people in abusive relationships that looks like he's glistening. This guy looks like he's glistening. But when you see the source, he's an abuser. Okay, um, you know, toxic environments, you know, you look at that environment over there and they all look like they're having fun, you're like, yo, let me go over there. You know, everybody's sniffing coke and stuff like that and you get into that, next thing you know, you're hooked. Okay, so not all that glistens is gold. Okay, and that's really the action of the day. The action of the day is this, okay? Check the source of the performance. Is it credible? And is it really the people that you wanna be around? Very simple today. All right, God bless you. Thank you for joining us for Morning Word. As we always say, we gen hope God's gift to us is life. What we do with that life is our gift back to God. God bless you. Join us for the next Morning Word. Obviously, you know, uh, please subscribe to our you know, YouTube channels and things like that so you get these Monday to Friday. And please share them with people who may want to want to get to know God and, you know, get an understanding or may, you know, be struggling to find something in, in the Word that, that there is relevance in this Word. So God bless you and see you soon.